You're listening to For Real Radio with Bria, Julia, Kayla, and Michael on WHITradio.org, the sound of Hudson County Schools of Technology in North Bergen, New Jersey. Here with Michael, Kayla, and Julia. Today we're giving our us. <laughs> today we're going to have a um, special show today discussing peer pressure. If you'd like to join this conversation, give us a call at 201-854-8224. All right. Well, um, to start off, guys, <laughs> have you guys ever um done something you never wanted to do? No. Mm. Lies. Go, Michael. I mean, go, Kayla. Um, hmm, that's... <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure I have, yeah, at one point, just because, you know, others were doing it. But, I mean, uh... Was I'm it uh, something that uh-huh. harmed yourself or anybody else? Let's just say okay. something I shouldn't have done. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, uh, you know, you go past that, so... Yeah. I've never done anything bad. So let's talk about why people do that. All right. Well, um, I think. <coughs> oh, I think personally, I think people do it <coughs> to go, to just follow the crowd, so they're not like left by themselves. <laughs> yeah. People um, are like pressured to do it because yes. um, so they can fit in and they can fit accepted. I right? think that's every teenager's. Um, yeah desire to just fit in with everybody and be normal and um yeah what do you think michael i absolutely agree i think that um even though we know something will hurt our bodies or our emotional state we do it anyway just to uh, feel accepted feel like one of the crowd and it's uh well it's wrong but <coughs> it's it's natural it's part of teenage and all you have to do is be informed and be educated about what you're doing exactly and you should have no problem. Peer pressure is usually very <coughs> negative. Uh, it makes you do things that you really don't want to do, but you, uh, we have a great need, especially when we're younger, to fit in and we don't want to stand out. We don't want to be ostracized and we don't want to be made fun of. So we <coughs> do things that uh, we may regret later on. So uh, a lot of people have uh, gone to jail or even worse because of peer pressure okay yeah and I um oh, okay well um i don't know like late the thing lately with peer pressure is you know you get into stealing drinking doing drugs taking dangerous risks or like or having sex and you know like sometimes you're not ready for those things and you don't want to do it but you want to fit in and Everyone around you is doing it. It seems like the it thing to do, so that's what... I think that um, teenagers don't think of, like, the consequences. And that there are long-term consequences. Long, 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 it's forever. It's more than that, too. It's because everybody else is doing it. Because, you know, others influence you. They ask you to do it. They tell you to do it, you know? Absolutely. Are there uh, many ways to prevent this? Uh, parents, like, do you think parents could do anything to prevent um, their kids' actions or choices they make? There was a story out of, uh, I don't know, some high school up in New England, and all the senior girls made a pact that they would all get pregnant. Yeah, and oh, that's, that, a and that, and that's a Lifetime movie. That's a Lifetime movie. No, that's a real movie. That's yeah, a real yeah, movie. Yeah, based on a real yeah. story. And, and that's rather uh, uh, extreme case, but uh, happens. You know, it, it became destructive actually. Yeah. And uh, that's that's the extent of what peer pressure can do. At least they had a short-term goal. <laughs> uh, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> oh I can't even imagine ever getting pregnant. Can you, Kayla? No. N- Michael, could mm-hmm. you well, be a father right now? Well, well, not physically. I, I don't think uh, that would work too well with my body, but yeah, uh-huh. I don't think it will either. I mean, he can't get pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> I said as a father. Oh like no, as a father. Okay. That would uh, <coughs> suck. That would suck. Wouldn't okay. happen. Yeah. All right, but uh, it's it's like the gangs. Um, uh, you have to commit some form of violence 
or even kill somebody so you get accepted into the gang. And uh, uh, people, especially inner city youth, maybe don't have uh, a family. Uh, it's very important to be part of something and they, they do whatever is necessary to, to be part of a, a, a group or a gang. Gives them some sort of identity. But, you know, what they have to do is unconscionable, really. And, um, but that's, wh that's what peer pressure can do. Yeah. Yes. <coughs> well, I don't know if I'm, um, are we done? No, no, no. <coughs> Sorry. Te technical error. <laughs> Julie? Um, well, there are ways to prevent um, being pressured into something you don't want to do, like par things that parents could help us with. They could um, talk to us and just give us positive advice and some consequences that they actually do to prevent this is they'll punish us or ground us and... Yeah. <coughs> okay. um, I don't know if um, like, you know, someone outside of yourself can really tell you about peer pressure like you have to know about it yourself you have to know the consequences yourself like you know when you're do what you're yeah, doing when you're getting peer pressure you have pressure. to have a, um, a good conscience <coughs> yeah like you have to listen to your gut like you don't feel like doing exactly. something if you're on it don't do it just because your friends do it I mean I'm not saying that the parents can make the choices for you but they could guide you like in the right direction yeah yes. absolutely um so do you think it's actually hard to um walk away and just say no Absolutely not. Nope. Absolutely not. It's because to be very honest, <coughs> let's uh, let's let's name a situation, right? Mm -hmm. Growing up, you were always I'm sure you uh, you've heard of Dare. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right? And you were always taught that uh, somebody, you know, f for example, cigarettes or drugs, somebody will be right there saying, "Hey, man, try this, and if you don't, you're not cool." You know, I I try this. Oh, you're a wimp if you don't try it. And that's honestly not how it happens. Yeah. Usually it's very recreational, and someone out of courteousness says, hey, you, you know, you want to try this? Or you, you want a hit, or do you want something like that? And uh, it's not that big a deal. All you have to do is say, oh, no thanks, man. And, uh, and people really don't get on your case if you say no. A lot of people say, wow, that's really good. You know, let's, let's uh, chill. Make your yes mean yes, and make your no mean no. And that goes for life in general. When you say no, make it mean no. All right, not like maybe. A lot of people say no, and then they get convinced, and the may no becomes maybe, and the maybe becomes yes. Make your no mean no. Yeah. No. That's no. Maybe. No. Okay. Maybe. Okay. Uh, <laughs> maybe. Um, is there? There's actually like um a positive peer pressure too. Um, yeah. Like, if you stay with the right crowd who doesn't do any not so great thing. Yeah, your, your crowd is... Most people likely you hang with just not going to do it. I you, mean... If you hang out with a crowd that's going somewhere, you'll probably go somewhere yourself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you hang out with a bunch of losers, you're going to become one yourself. Yep. It really is that powerful. Uh, guys, we're going to have to wrap it up t for today. It's really a short show, but we have to uh, uh, wrap it up. But we can continue this, Julie. Okay. okay. All right. Yes. You want to end the show for us? Uh, I guess. All right. Um. Are you do you guess or are you gonna end it? Maybe. Yes. So we just gonna sit no. here waiting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, let's wrap this up. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoy your day. This is for real radio here at WHIT. For radio. For real. For real radio on whitradio.org. You just listened to. For real uh, radio on whitradio.org. Yeah, I'm hosting yeah. County Schools of Technology. Northburg in New Jersey, have a great day.